be most producer to get a first job. Hi again, welcome back. It's Thursday at the moment, it's 10 to 9 in the morning. Got a 9 a.m. lecture, quite literally rolled out of bed. I had a very late night yesterday. It's not even a lecture, it's like a drop-in session. They like to call it masterclass. Every week it's like a different topic and like someone new who's like a master in that field is giving that lecture, if that makes sense. So yeah, today's one I thought would be quite interesting so I decided to go, but um, it starts in like eight minutes and I haven't eaten anything. I didn't even eat dinner yesterday, so I feel like I'm just gonna make a smoothie. It's two hours, so nine to 11 and um, um, I know a smoothie's not gonna suffice, but I have eight minutes. Do you know what I mean? Like I don't have time. At 11 I'll like shower quick because I'm going to brunch with one of my friends. We're meeting at like 11.30. I need to leave the house at like 11.25. But right now I'm feeling very bummy and very bogged down. So yeah, that's really great. But um, I think this talk will be interesting. So basically today's I think is like about producing and freelancing. And then there could be one on color grading, one on offline editing, online editing, and just like stuff like that, if that makes sense. And there's someone new doing each thing. I'm probably just gonna chill anonymously and just have my camera off. It's 54 so I'm gonna go make this smoothie and then we'll do this lecture and then we'll catch up in a bit. <laughs> to leave the house i'm going with one of my friends but i actually don't know where we're going we're just gonna like walk around and see i have one place in mind this is my outfit of the day this like rugby shirt sort of thing from goose and gander blue jeans from boohoo air force ones and then this crossbody bag as well from boohoo i actually used my iron for the first time today I had to iron this shirt and the collar but yeah that's the plan i'm gonna leave in a sec i'll be back home maybe around like one and then i'm just gonna spend the rest of the day editing doing some work i did my eyebrows and that's about it because i just didn't have time to like do my makeup and stuff but this is gonna have to do. I might tie my hair up. I feel like I look very preppy. I feel like the hair up wasn't a vibe. I feel like I messed up. That's a vibe. Okay, let's go. You don't get quiet like me. Run up who starts like me. Came up, make sounds like me. They cannot talk like me. They cannot walk where I walk like me. They turn to rock on a song with me. They turn to hop on a song for free. But they ain't fuck with me, so I say no, no, no No, 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 no I do not fuck with no face shit Okay, so I just got back, but I had to put tracksuit bottoms on My jeans were so uncomfortable I hate wearing jeans when I just don't have to be wearing jeans Do you know what I mean? Like, it's just feels so unnecessary. I wanted to show you this skincare stuff I got. So basically, before we went to get food, there was this like natural skincare place that I've always wanted to check out. It's called South Sea Bathing Hut. So we went in there and I got two things. I can't lie, I did want to get more, but I was just like, let me just relax, start off small. It's literally just natural skincare from the seaside. So like sea salt from the sea and they make it just like right there in the shop and everything. I just love it. I spent like 15 minutes like talking to the woman about my skin. Two things I got this I've literally never seen this before obviously I'm sure it exists somewhere or like people have been doing it but I personally have never seen it and it's a um, botanical facial steam mix sort of thing I really enjoy steaming my face it's good for the throat it's good for the skin like yeah she just knew so much how to like help me she was like you should stay away from this you should do this there were three different types of these like mixes and then she was like this is the one you need like you need this one and I just really trusted her and it's really weird because I've been meaning to use more chamomile like whether it's tea or just like 
whatever it is and this has chamomile in it so i was like yeah like i really know that you know what you're talking about and you just basically put a little sprinkle of this in your like steaming water she was like make sure you use distilled water or bottled water like hot bottled water or hot distilled water i was like okay and um yeah you put this in the water steam your face as you normally would and then you can use the leftover water you can put it in like a spray bottle and then keep that in the fridge and then use that as like a toner which is so sick and then the other one i got like the mini tester this was like this is like 650 i think this was two pounds i didn't want to get the full bar of soap just in case i oh this is coconut in it i'm really upset i am oh I'm so annoyed at least it was only two pounds but i'm so upset okay this doesn't have coconut but this does oh anyway this is a soap and it's like good for the face and the, i i'm so upset i won't even there's no point in me even talking about it because i can't use it okay i know it doesn't seem like i was so upset but like i genuinely was so angry and annoyed i just don't show much emotion when it comes to extreme emotions do you know what i mean like if i'm really excited or really upset i'll be like yeah i'm like really upset or like i'm so excited yeah like that's just me i don't know why i don't know what i'm saying now but you get me like i was just really upset i'm allergic to coconut and i still haven't found a home for that soap <laughs> But um, yeah. But anyway, it's 2 p.m. right now. So I'm gonna get to work. I'm gonna sit at my desk, do some work until maybe like six, seven, and then have dinner and then just continue after dinner. So nothing exciting from now on, but um, yeah. <laughs> Good morning, it is Friday. It's currently like 9.20. I need to leave the house at 9.30. I'm waiting for my blender to charge. I forgot to charge it because I haven't eaten breakfast. I was so lazy this morning. Like I really just did not want to get out of bed. So all I've done is showered and like got dressed. It's annoying because like I put everything I need to blend in the blender and now the blender just won't blend because it's out of charge. But anyway, so I've got my lecture in person. It's more just like a little meeting with our production groups. So that's calm, it shouldn't take too long. And then I think I need to like pick up some stuff in terms before heading back here but yeah that is the current plan this is my outfit of the day very just casual you know boohoo man boohoo this is new look i'm pretty sure the sweatshirt yeah i'm really loving wearing white got my white mask i really hope i can have this smoothie before i go i'm on a tight time schedule so yeah anyway let's go i have five minutes it's like a healthy slush puppy in a way it's so frozen <laughs> I went to town, can you see me? I don't know, had my lecture and then I went to town to pick up some prints. I went to the post office and I also got two bucket hats. I'm so happy with them. I could not resist. I first of all lost my white one that I had and I feel like this one is low-key built better anyway. And um, then this nice like camel beige one. And the material is actually like really thick. I don't know, it's kind of just a nice vibe. I think right now I'm just gonna eat lunch. I'm gonna have leftovers, some plantain, I'm so excited. And then I'm just doing uni work the rest of the day. I've got so much uni work to do. I was also meant to do my workout today and um, it was saying it was gonna be like 46 minutes and I was just not having it. No, especially when I needed to be in uni for 10, like I was not gonna wake up at 6 a.m. to exercise. Simple as, but yeah. Okay, it is Sunday, Sunday morning. It's currently 11.20. I'm about to get ready, like do my makeup and stuff because the video that's going out today, I forgot to film the Instagram part of the ad. So I need to do that today. My fabric paint arrived, my paint brushes arrived. So I'm finally gonna DIY my jeans. On the weekend, I like to take it easy-ish. Yesterday was Saturday, I didn't set an alarm. I woke up at like nine, I felt like I had a lion, even though that was still like low key 
kind of early today i woke up at like 9 30 10 ish i think so that felt nice um <laughs> but yesterday i was just working on my website the whole day for biotas kapaya if you haven't checked it out already feel free to check it out and um i can be getting ready at the same time as talking i just realized and then in the evening after dinner i was doing some uni work i was doing some research and part of my project kind of loosely is kind of just like looking at like representation and diversity and you know racism in the uk media i was doing some research on this lady called Afwa Hush. like she had a debate on Sky News and I was just getting really vexed and um, yeah that's kind of how I spent my evening just like watching these debates <laughs> about racism in the UK and just a bit of light reading you know today I'm just trying to take it easy do some things that don't really involve me looking at my phone and my laptop and stuff so I'm just gonna speed through this getting ready I am gonna do the eyelashes again these eyelashes have really lasted me time I'm listening to like one of these like daily mix things on Spotify I love Spotify with all my heart by the way my dream how great would it be if I could work with Spotify? The way I love Spotify, they're constantly finding new ways to supply us with new music. I don't know any other streaming service doing it like Spotify. Why, why they hate okay, hold on. Okay, I finished my makeup. I'm gonna film this Instagram thing, take some pictures and stuff, and then we'll DIY my jeans. I'm Hey guys, okay, so I want to talk to you quickly about... set up I put these like white bin bag sort of things on the ground I've like sellotaped it I need to hoover my floor so we're gonna ignore that but yeah this is what we're working with got my jeans I haven't tried them on yet but I know they fit because they're basically the same as ones I already have and then um, my paintbrushes and some white paint so yeah okay so it's 3 25 finished eating lunch I was looking for some inspo and I finally found a design that I want to go with so I'm ready to start I'm going for the white flames at the bottom of the jeans and like on the back pockets I'm really excited about these ones because I know I'll like actually wear these if that makes sense because obviously the bleach ones I did didn't really work so I'm trying a different way but yeah <laughs> I'm not really sure how to do this like a hundred percent so I'm just kind of weighing it but I'm gonna use eyeshadow to draw the flames on because I feel like that's kind of the smartest thing to do like you don't even have to be like an artist I just feel like it's a really like cathartic thing I just really rate it you know so basically this paint it says that you paint it on as normal and then you kind of iron it for five minutes and then after it's been ironed you can then wash it like normal up to 40 degrees which is so fine it's 3 30 right now i'm gonna say i'm gonna assume i'll be done maybe around like 5 30. um i'm just gonna chill listen to music and yeah so let's start <laughs> baby i know that you wanted some time away i wonder why but i still gave you the time today i don't know how to love but you're gonna show me the way Jackson. i don't want nobody else to come and get in the way if you stab me in the back then you dig in the grave i can't trust nobody else because your life is a man i swear i did not need no help i've been feeling the pain show me that you really love you ain't playing no games i know i know you can call okay so this is the update but what i'm starting to think i'm starting to think that i shouldn't do the back of the jeans if that makes sense so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna do the flames on the pockets at the back of the jeans and then like leave the rest and then once these are all dry and i've like you know settled into them a bit i can then see if i want to do the back but something tells me like they're okay like this like just plain on the back and then just the flames on the front for some reason because i just don't want to i don't want to overpower it you know but that's kind of where my head's at at the moment but so far so good this is so much faster than i thought it's only like 4 20 right now and obviously the pockets at the back will be so much quicker so yeah let's continue now i might pick up the phone just don't call from a number no i know i know i know that you wanted to be with me it take time take time to 
okay i'm enjoying i'm enjoying i don't really think these are flames these are more like triangles they don't really look like flames but still it's so fine i'm gonna do this one now so yeah okay and it's done i feel like this is defo enough like i feel like i don't need to do the flames on the back but i'm gonna let this dry and then maybe try them on <laughs> It's like 7.30 right now. I just ordered food because I still have credit from Uber Eats. But the jeans, oh my gosh, I'm so in love with them. They're not like done yet. I know they look done, but they're done, but they're not, if that makes sense. Because I basically have to iron them. So I'm just going to wait till tomorrow to iron them. But yeah, I'm so, so happy with how they turned out. When they're just lying on the ground, I was like, mm. But when I put them on, I was like, yeah. So a successful DIY. I feel like I'm definitely getting better. In the future, I'm definitely going to like play around with different colors and like just do more like custom things. If you have any ideas or like some inspo and stuff like that, feel free to let me know. But yeah, right now, just waiting for my food to arrive and I'm gonna eat. I feel like I'm just, that better be my food on the way. Oh, so excited. But yeah, I feel like I'm gonna end this video here. So thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, definitely make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and turn notifications on so you don't miss any videos. All my social media links will be in the description below also, so feel free to check those out. But yeah, thanks again for watching. I'm gonna go now. I'll see you next time. So bye. Yeah.